Top of the morning to you. I'm Jim Flanagan, broker of record with Cobalt Banker Flanagan Realty, and today's Tuesday. Now, I know it's been a while since you've had your last treat, and what does treat stand for? That's right, Tom's River Real Estate Trend. So I thought I'd share an interesting trend with you this morning. I have a couple of quotes up here on the board. These are quotes, are our actual status updates from realtors across the country on Facebook within the last week. Now the first one, listings piling up, came from a, a real estate agent down in the North Carolina area, not a Cobalt Banker agent. The second one, hope we find buyers, was actually a comment to the previous status update from a, from a real estate practitioner in the same brand, not Cobalt Banker. The last quote, what's Cobalt Banker doing? This actually isn't a status update, but a quote from a local competitor here in Tom's River. A real estate practitioner who used to work with Cobalt Banker Flanagan Realty, but moved on to one of our competitors in the hopes of greener pastures. Well, I said, what Cobalt Banker is doing is continuing the momentum and the demand created by the home buyer tax credit that expired on April 30th. We've taken the traditional seller's concession and we've combined it with the national marketing and brand awareness of Cobalt Banker with the participation of the sellers in the Cobalt Banker system and the technology available through CobaltBanker.com and Cobalt Banker on location, and we flagged all of our participating listings so today's buyers can still cash in on up to an $8,000 credit toward any and all closing costs, and our sellers can still get more buyers for their homes. So, does that answer your question, Mr. Competitor? Let me ask you a question. What's your brand doing to help you and your fellow sales associates survive the post-tax credit lull? That was about the same response I got on the other end of the phone. And the rest of the day to you.